Hey guys, how's it going? My name is RGJ Runner, and welcome to my Let's Play of Raya, an indie horror game set in a Thailand hospital where you have to solve a murder paranormal mystery of ghosts and ghoulies and other weird, wacky, and crazy wonderful stuff. So let's get right into it. Do I want to start? Of course, I do want to start. Why do you think I pressed start in the first place? I don't need to be asked twice. Okay, fine, let's check out our surroundings first. Okay, nice hospital bed. Little uh, locker here. Or cabinet. Cozy couch. 32 inch, I'm assuming HD TV. Some sort of another desk. And, of course, the exit to your room and your own personal bathroom. Holy crap, have I ever get beaten up again I hope to end up in hospital like this I mean, this is fucking swanky nothing like the regional hospital gives you if to even have room all right uh, anyway uh, enough negativity let's get on with it okay what's this um can I see what that is again Do I have an inventory? Okay, no. Uh, I have no idea what that is. I probably will never know. Oh well. Oh, a mysterious note. A note saying, I'm going to buy a drink. Be right back. But she's not coming back, or he is never coming back. Let's face facts here, okay? Can I open this? No. Okay, things got very basic all of a sudden. Okay. Alright, the door opening goes. Open this for me, thank you. I actually need to use the boober. Okay, privacy please. Come, pri privacy. Pri hey, don't close it. I can't close the freaking door. Come on, this doesn't bode well so far. Come on, let me close it. There we go. Jesus Christ, the door opening and closing mechanic is very clunky, very, very clunky. So what now? Do I have to use the pooper? Oh my god, we actually have legs and a torso. Holy crap, this is miles ahead of Call of Duty. Anyway, let's view this. A spooky newspaper clipping. Oh dear. Oh, and we can rotate it. Right by Bon Bon. And yeah, I can't speak that. A newspaper article saying five people brutally murdered in horrifying tragedy. Yeah, that is a bit of a doozy. Hi! Did someone enter my room? It's just my private quarters. You get out. Get out right now before I get mad. Okay. Oh! Oh my god. A very tall ghost lady appears. Hey! No! Use the public bedroom. This is mine. Mine alone. Mine alone. No! You... Hey. I will not fall prey to your intimidation tactics. Take more than a few knocks at the door to scare me. <laughs> hey! You didn't teleport behind me, did you? No? Okay, fine. No. Jeez. I could have sworn that came from behind me, but I don't know. Maybe it didn't. Okay, can't open that, so the only way is forward. Okay, game, what else you got for me? What else? Oh, Jesus, that closed pretty fast. And yes, like all hospital doors, they automatically lock behind you. 
Yeah, I heard a bit of shuffling in that room, but I'm just going going to ignore it. And I'm I'm glad someone is getting a giggle and a jolly out of my expense. Ooh, an envelope. Oh my god, it's a trap. An, em an empty envelope. Yeah, now there's going to be something scary behind me, I bet. Watch. Oh, hello, wheelchair. Long time no see. Yeah, definitely not the scariest thing by far. I don't know, maybe it'll poke me in the butt. Maybe it might have given me a bit of a hop, but no. It just randomly appeared there. Hey! Hey! Don't be giving me none of that guff! None of that back jet! None of that nonsense! No, none of it! I'm having none of that! No! Oh my god, open up! Nope, 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 nope! Okay, who am I and how did I get here? I don't know, I'm guessing all will be revealed sooner or later. Surprise jump scare! No? Oh, okay then. All is good with the world. Oh, Jesus. The Rung Kong? Yeah, I, I do that every day. Oh, hello, bouncy ball. Yeah, I, I the Rung Kong every day before I get up. Sorry, after I get up. I Rung Kong twice a day. Whatever Rung Kong is. But I'm pretty sure it's some form of exercise. I hear it's good for the uh, upper body. See, see, if you run Kong twice a day, you can be as fit as me. Maybe. Good. Fucking wheelchair again. I'm happy to see you too. Jesus. And you brought buddies. Okay. That's good. That's Mr. and Mrs. Wheelchair. And Grandpa Wheelchair. Hey, Grandpa Wheelchair, how are you doing? You doing good? That's good. Oh, okay, fine. How rude. Okay, because so I can't go that way. I'm going this way. Or not, okay. Whoa, okay, what's happening here? Whoa, I guess I'm not going down that way. Oh, shit. Come on, open that door! And the run! Why? Why am I the asshole? I didn't do anything! Not that I know of! Oh my god! Oh my god, open it! No, I'm not getting back anywhere! Oh no, 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 no! None of that! I'm having none of your nonsense, lady! None of it! Oh god. Oh dearie me. I'm safe! Or not. No. No, 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 no. You get back. Okay, that wasn't as scary as I thought it was going to be. Raya. Okay, fine. That was the prologue, I'd imagine. Oh, this is where it begins. Chapter 1, Marissa. Quarter past a.m. in the morning. There were so many stories of ghosts inhabiting this hospital. Because of those stories, the hospital was forced to close down temporarily. However, there are still some strange rumors coming from people who pass by there. They said they saw mysterious shadows and even heard horrifying screams. 
Some even said that the local junkies gathered in that place. But that's just what I've heard. The last time I saw Arya was here, years ago. That day, she mysteriously disappeared. But then the other day, I received a message from Arya saying she was at the hospital. That's the reason I'm here tonight. And it's probably the reason you didn't bring a flashlight. And probably the reason why you didn't tell anyone. And it's the reason why you're going to end up dying a most painful death just like your friend. This place has changed a lot. That key's done some real damage to this place. I don't think it was the case. I think it was more of the, the paranormal shit that was actually going on. You know, look. Yeah, he's either dead or he's taking a nap. I, I'm assuming it's the it's the latter because it's too early in the game for any death. That'll come later. Jeez, that was that was an obvious pathway, and I probably missed another note or two along the way back there because I didn't explore properly but oh well that's the way shit goes and are these mice oh no they're cockroaches oh I do have a flashlight okay more specifically I have a flashlight app what's the deal with this shrine I don't know. You're from Thailand. You work it out. You should know about all, all this shit, although you're the most Scottish sounding Thailandese person I've ever come across. Oh, Jesus. Okay, hello, Gecko. Oh fuck Jesus <laughs> Okay <laughs> You know that was funny I should have caught him and kept him as a pet At least I would have had some form of companionship during this spook filled journey Oh I can run Okay good and someone is scraping something along the gravel. Isn't that nice? And my cockroach buddies are showing me the way. Okay, show me where to go. This way. This way to the wall. Okay. Don't think I have that type of powers. Yet. Don't think I can just morph through any object I want to. Okay, this seems pretty straightforward, but oh no, cheers, I can't go through them. Oh, I can, okay, good. It's normally things like this block your way and you can't be overcome no matter what you do. You know, typical horror cliche. Well, typical indie horror cliche. And is that, that Araya? Araya? Is that you? I don't know what it. Why don't you get up and ask her? Oh no, I can't get back through here. Oh god, oh no, yeah, the only way now is forward. Yeah, I'm definitely too too big to fit my fat ass through there. Okay, right, we're finally inside the spooky Please, hospital then. Uh, 
and off we go to our doom. Okay, maybe not. That was rather rude. I guess we're not going through there that, that easily. And uh, oh, look, we have a whole family of wheelchairs. That's right. That is good. You've been acting very strange during high school, especially in our last couple of years. You had serious problems with your mood swings, and it really pushed Put people away. I was your only friend at the time. Seriously, what type of thai person are you? The most Scottish sounding one I've ever, I've ever seen, or ever come across. And, and oh my god, I've seemed to lost my legs. So I am a ghost person now. I'm one of them. Or maybe I just can't see them in the dark. Maybe that's it. Ooh, key. Not just any key. The master key. Find diffuses to restore power. Oh, okay. And this is where the scripted jump scares will come into play, I imagine. Okay, I can go in here now because I have the master key. Hey! What? Don't give me none of that lip. Okay. No fuses in sight yet. Hey, hey, hey! Oh. They'll be scraping the walls with their long nails. Okay, I'm assuming a box fell out there, but I didn't see it. A newspaper article saying Dr. Finnage Watanavarat, General Director of the Department of Health Services Board, released a statement that Napa One Hospital has to close down temporarily. The reason was that the increase of reports saying that sections of the hospital were closed. Electricity had been turned off in a few rooms. The hospital was understaffed and the emergency room was not reaching required health standards. This all combined with the numerous complaints about hygiene problems has led to the decision to close the hospital. Alright. So no scripted jump scares as of yet. Which is totally surprising. Because indie horrors are normally full of cheap ass jump scares. But still, it's early days yet. Oh well, yeah, I didn't realize it but I picked up a fuse. I just saw something shiny and picked it up but I really Take in the details of it. Okay, come on. Last one's gotta be true here. Then again, maybe not. Ooh, note. The text of this document is hard to read. It says something about the temporary shutdown of the hospital. Hmm. Okay. Very good. Anything else? Okay, fuse a Rooney. Hey! Don't you be screaming at me. Okay, fine, the last fuse. Now I can turn on the power. So, there's n nothing spooky around here? No spooktaculars? Okay. Okay, there's got to be one now. Okay, I am very surprised. Because anyone who's played, or any YouTuber who's played any indie horrors, you know, the typical amnesias, the typical Unity engine horror games, they're always full of jump scares. Okay, fine, I guess this is more story oriented. I like that. 
fuck can I go in here now? Right. I had this security scanner here, so do I need a key card? Okay. That's good. At least it's not sending me on a wild goose chase. Everything seemed normal during today's patrol, however, I saw Jit near the old building again. I think he's hiding something there. I'm sure he was holding something, but I don't know what. Rama. Okay, who is this Rama person? Do you mean ramen noodles? Okay, that was pretty funny. I apologize. Okay, I guess we can go through here now. Oh, and I have boobs and legs, more importantly. Okay, good. Very good indeed. Okay, game save. Right, thanks for saving my game every 10 minutes. I appreciate that. Oh, frickin' box, watch where you're falling. Okay, a few objects. Yeah, another scary newspaper clipping probably riddled with death. A newspaper article saying engineer killed by single shot to the head found in abandoned taxi. Yes, death, death, and more death. This is what this game is about. Okay, is there anything in here? No, nothing shiny. Okay. I'm clearly done with this section. Unless there's anything else left here. Any more notes? No, okay. I like how the notes stand out. Okay, props to the developer. Blah, 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 blah. Props to the developer of this game. I'd rather not check. I'd rather not check each and every object within the game to see if it's of any use. Okay, and I heard a fumbling from in here. Okay. Oh, and there's another note. I saw Jit again today, but he was with someone. It looks like they were trading something. I wonder what. It's so suspicious, but I've already reported to the boss. I guess I'll have to wait and see. Rama. Alright. I guess he must be one of the druggos that Marissa mentioned in the dialogue beforehand. Okay. So... There's nothing else I need here, no? Oh, there's a note. I need, need to get to that somehow. But first, let me open this door. Hi! What was that? Oh, I'm guessing just a random sound effect. Where is this? Oh my god, it's Raya. She's... Speaking to me from the dead. Or maybe she's using a speakerphone. Or an intercom. Okay, can't get through there yet. A newspaper article saying, after a Napawan hospital was forced to close down for, unforese for the unforeseeable future, new problems have arisen. All patients were moved to neighboring hospitals. However, one seems to be missing. A woman has come forward stating that her husband, who had been hospitalized in Napa One Hospital for a while, could not be found on any of the transfer patients list. If anyone has any information, please call the police. Right, I will do. But he's probably he's probably gone. Probably dead. Or maybe just my first stroll. Down the old long walk. On the day I A I A. And maybe he met a little girl and started to talk. On the grand stuff. Yeah, yeah. And he asked me, friend, what's the fella to do if her name was Mary Lou? <laughs> what the hell was that? 
Oh boy, I'm coming out with such nonsense. Oh, there's Arya. Hey, Arya, come. Hey. Why do you keep running away? I don't know. Maybe it's because you're Scottish. Just a wee bit Scottish. And she, and she may be a wee bit racist. But either way, that's not the problem here. That wasn't a run, that was more like a casual walk. Okay, the door seems to be bugging out there for some reason. And we got ourselves another note. I have this hatred inside me. It, it, it's growing stronger each day. I think it's started to affect my daily life. People are starting to look at me on the street. I'm so lonely. Would you like to trade places with me? All right, who are you asking that to? No, unless that note was supposed to be for me. Maybe. But either way, we've... Oh, what the hell am I doing? There's a door back here. I didn't even try it. Well, I can glitch through it, but I can't open it. Okay. So I guess I have to go back this way. Maybe this door's open now? No, that's still locked. Hey, but I'm supposed to have the master key. Unless the master key only works for one section. Okay, I can go in here now, but who needs a master key when you have a, a door opening ghost lead away? Okay, now close it, close it. Oh, just fucking close the door, you useless git. There we go. Now through here. And that's gonna slam my face. No? Okay. Okay, what was that? Please tell me that was one of the local drugos and not a scary ghost. Oh, let me read that. Newspaper article saying recently married woman admits to killing her previous boyfriend for not marrying her. Well, I guess if that's part of your creed, part of, part of your culture, who am I to judge? <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. That, that was bad. I take that back. And as I was saying, I hope it's a druggie. At least he's a real person. He may be crazy, but he's real. I have to kill them all before I can start the ritual. Okay, he's a real crazy person. Oh my god. Nope. None of that. I'm out of here. Good luck and thanks. But I will not be participating in your ritual. Your, your, blah, 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 your ritual. No, none of that. None of that bullshit. None of your shenanigans, okay? Hey, you. hey me? Oh, oh, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Oh my god. Oh my god, run! Oh, move your ass. Oh my god. No. No. Oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh. My god. oh. No, 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 no. I'm trapped. I'm trapped. Oh no. No, no, no. Come on. Climb. Climb like your freaking monkey man. Or a monkey woman. Jeez, he's not. He's not still chasing me, is he? Okay, good. I'm not even sure if I'm going the right way. Ooh, Jesus. Okay, follow the shadow, that's the best thing to do. Oh, okay, that was just a dead end. And I can't 
go through here either. Oh god, there's no end to this vent, is there? Oh, speak of the devil. Yeah, leap. There we go. Oh, he's going to begin chasing me again, isn't he? Push or pull. Oh, I can't do any of those, but at least I'm safe for now. For now, but he's definitely going to come barreling out of somewhere. You just watch. I mean, look, they'll probably end up coming down from this elevator. Or through that door, more than likely. Oh, jeez, that was fast. So I guess I'm... I'm safe. Maybe? Perhaps? Or not! Jeez, what was that? <laughs> what the hell? It went from full on British to complete Japanese Kung Fu martial artist. Oh my god. And oh, the security dude had a picture of his girlfriend. Conveniently blurred out. Okay, so this is chapter 2, and I'm playing as Rama. So it turns out the guy was napping on the job. And I guess I'm going to be the unlikely hero of the game. But either way, guys, I will end it here. I think I'll just leave it as a chapter per video, not including the prologue. Well, including the prologue for this episode. Otherwise, it'd be too short. So, you know what to do. If you like this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up. Comment, favorite, share, and subscribe. And I will see you in the next one. So, until next time, see ya.